welcome to Behind the Music for Daily Hope. I'm Kristen Holton Prouty, and this week we're thinking about change, the different seasons of life. I know when we're young, we think about all the things that we have ahead of us and all the great things that we're gonna do and all the things we're going to accomplish. We don't think we're ever going to get old. We always think we're going to be young and so many things coming. And it's true, there are many things that we have to look forward to as we go through life. But this weekend at Victory, we're celebrating the end of a season, the retirement of Pastor Steve, who's given so much of his life for the church, and especially here at Victory for the last several years. So I've been thinking a lot about, you know, still in Easter with death and resurrection and old and new, and what does life hold in all these different seasons? Today I had the opportunity to play for memorial service for a woman who lived 95 years. And I was listening to the different eulogies and all the many things that she had done in her life. And every person who got up to talk about her, the one thing they said was how consistently she'd been in church, she'd served, she loved God, she was faithful, she always kept Jesus as the priority of her life. And I think for many of the people that we hold in high esteem in our lives, the ones who have been influential, they will say the same thing, that they've tried their whole life to follow where he leads and to just keep focused on the thing that is important, only Jesus. So no matter what season of life we're in, if we're little and we think we have the whole world ahead of us, if we're not so young anymore even though we think we might be whatever it is so long as we keep our eyes focused on Jesus everything else is going to work out we don't have to try and control everything we just do the best we can and stay focused there's a hymn that we're going to be singing this weekend called turn your eyes upon Jesus and this was written by Helen Hemmel now Helen was born in England and when she was 12, her family brought her to the United States, which was a major culture shock. But she still took the talents that God had given her. She was a singer, she loved music, and she wrote hymns. And she used that to write a hymnal that was used by an evangelist and has blessed people probably around the world. We don't even know how far people's reach, we don't even know how far our reach will go. But she wanted to make sure that she did the best that she could with what she was given. So turn your eyes upon Jesus. It's a lovely little hymn. The words are, turn your eyes upon Jesus. Look full in his wonderful face. And the things of earth will grow strangely dim in the light of his glory and grace. So that's our prayer as we go through this transition period. Something is ending. Another thing is beginning, both for us and for Pastor Steve. And we're just going to keep our eyes focused on Jesus and trust and believe that he knows what's best for all of us. I will be with you again next week back at the Sanctuary of Victory. Take care.